Hello, and welcome to our tutorial on ProQuest Flow. This tutorial has been created to show you how to create a ProQuest Flow account, import resources into your Flow account, and create a reference page. What's Flow, you ask? This is an account that allows you to organize all your research documents like journal, newspaper, and magazine articles that you find during your everything search and put it into one convenient location that you can access anywhere you have Wi-Fi. Why do you need a Flow account? Your Flow account has a lot of useful tools that will be explored in further tutorials, but our focus today will be on importing documents to create a reference page. Let's begin. As you can see, we have already started by performing an everything search. If you're having trouble remembering how to do a search Niagara College Library for Resources, please refer to the How Do I Find Library Resources tutorial. The first step that we want to take is to click the login link found at the top right hand corner of the page, right here highlighted in green. Next, we want to select the No Account Sign up here link. Next, enter your Niagara College email account in the box provided. You will need to use your college email address so, the, so that Flow can verify your account access. Remember, your email address should follow the format shown in the screen, which is username at ncstudents.niagaracollege.ca. Just a reminder, that your username is the same as your Blackboard username. After you've filled in your email, click the check button. You will then be prompted to choose a password for your account. After you have picked a password, click the sign up button. You will then receive an email from Flow to confirm and activate your account. Click the link or copy and paste the link into the address bar of your browser to complete confirmation. Once you confirm and activate your Flow account, you will be prompted to set it up. Here you will fill in your first and last name. See here I put my first name, Bianca, and easy last name. Select your area of study or other under Niagara College drop-down menu. Right here, selected other. Um, select undergraduate student under the role drop down menu. See, I've selected those there. Once you've finished filling out your info, select the next button. Please skip the displayed tutorial. Our focus today will be on the basic tools of Flow. You will have the opportunity to experience Flow's advanced tools in a different session. Just hit skip here. Now that we have our Flow account set up, we are going to click on the Back to Library Search found near the top of the left-hand corner of the page. We are now going to learn how to add documents to our Flow account from the Everything Search. Click here. We are now back to our original Everything Search screen. We are going to add a few resources to our folder. The resources that we add will be put into the folder icon near the top right hand corner of the page. Put in this folder right here. Uh, to add resources to your folder, click on the fo plus folder icon located beside the item that you would like to add to your folder. Just like that. You will notice that the plus folder icon has changed. It is now it now is a checkmark folder icon indicating that you've added this resource to your folder icon located at the top of the page. You'll notice that we've added two uh, resources to our folder. Now that we've added these resources to our folder, we can click on it to access our Flow account. By clicking on the folder icon found at the top of the Everything Search page, it has brought us back to our Flow account. You'll notice that all of the resources that we have selected earlier are now found in our account. There they are. To begin making our reference page, check mark 
the all documents box right here. So we just want to check that. Click the create Bibli uh, bibliography tab that is represented by a quotation mark icon to make your reference page. Click there. You will notice that we are creating a reference page from the resources that we have selected. Right there. Next, I'm going to click on the citation style search box and select the style that we need. You can, you can perform a search if your style is not listed. I'm going to select the latest edition of APA. Ta-da! We have created a reference page, which you can copy and paste at the end of your research paper. Please remember that automated citations created by Flow are not always correct. It is important to always double check your reference page to make sure that it is correct. Please consult the citation help subject guide found on the library's website. And here it is right here. And there's the link right at the bottom of the page. To recap, today we learned how to create a flow account, import documents into our flow account, and create a reference page. If you're having any problems, please feel free to contact, contact us using live chat Email us at library at niagaracollege.ca. Contact us at the Welland or Niagara on the Lake campus via phone or just come into the library. We are always here to help you. Thanks for listening.